Hey everybody, Brett here at Pure Pursuit. Today we got in this 2012 CLS 63 AMG. Uh, we're gonna do the interior features video on this one. If you're only catching this portion of the videos, uh, make sure to check the exterior walk around as well as the test drive video. Uh, moving right into this car, uh, we've got the memory seats and the multi-function seat adjustment uh, on the door panel here. Uh, power light, windows, locks, mirrors, auto headlights. We'll move on to the steering wheel. Paddle shifters on the back, electronic tilt telescope, dynamic cruise control on the back as well. Uh, moving to the face of the steering wheel, we have audio controls and Bluetooth on the right side. On the left side, we can control some of the settings inside of your center screen there. Um, right now, it's showing the mileage, hours clock, miles per gallon, and uh, average speed, distance to empty, speedometer trip meter and mileage, and then trip computer, and another trip computer, back to the uh, distance to empty. We'll switch the screen now. You can go from trip screen, navigation, audio settings, telephone Bluetooth connection, driver assist features. Uh, this is where you can change your distance display, pre-safe brake, attention assist, blind spot assist, lane keep assist. You can change your settings for your instrument cluster, your lights, the vehicle settings, convenience features, and you can reset all of those. Uh, you can switch it to AMG display screen, uh, which gives you the active uh, oil temperature and water temperature. Uh, turns off your uh, eco mode for start stop. And then we go back to the regular trip screen. Uh, push bus button start. We'll move to the center console here, and uh, I'll go ahead and open this up. 12 volt auxiliary power, USB port, as well as an iPod port. Uh, you've got the center control knob for your audio navigation screen here. Um, we'll go ahead and switch it to navigation. Okay, now we've got it on the bottom. Uh, you can change your guide, traffic, position, or destination. Uh, moving back to the top, we can get out of the nav screen, go to audio settings. Uh, right now we are listening to some FM. can change the frequency, HD radio, station information, presets. All right, you can see there's AM, FM, and WB as your options in there. Uh, treble, bass, balance, fade, surround, Logic 7 settings. Uh, we'll move back up to the top, phone settings. You can pair a phone, uh, Bluetooth, I don't have my phone in here, or we could pair mine and display how that's done. Uh, if you have any questions about that, uh, you can give us a call. One of us will grab a camera and, and teach you how to do it. Uh, video settings, uh, right now the DVD changer is empty, uh, but you can watch DVDs on here. System settings, you can see we have a digital clock to go with this. Uh, JWC analog timepiece. Uh, you can turn off the display or you can go into different settings, uh, change your text reader speed, voice control for uh, Bluetooth settings, rear view camera settings, language, activate your Bluetooth, and you can reset everything. Okay, moving down to the uh, radio controls and other controls. In case you didn't want to run through all your features using the scroll button, uh, we've got radio, disc, navigation, telephone, turn everything off, system settings, Bluetooth buttons, um, volume controls here, station changing, uh, preset heated and cooled seats for driver and passenger. Power rear sunshade. Eco mode, in case you want to have a little bit better fuel economy, it's uh, auto start stop when it's available, and uh, parking sensors. Moving down here, we've got the dual climate control. Right now I've got it set to auto. Uh, you can change the temperature, it'll read out in your display up top, or it also has the temperature displayed on the dial. Um, passenger side, just as easy to change that. Uh, you can change your fan speeds, AC. Uh, rear defrost, different vent controls, uh, pretty standard right there. Uh, your dial here is what you use to change 
the uh, different dynamics of the vehicle. Right now it's in C for comfort, S for sport, S plus for sport plus, M for manual settings. Uh, you can also turn off the traction control, adjust your AMG suspension to sport handling, and your AMG button, which you can preset uh, different configurations to, to be ideal for you. So you can just press that and it goes into whatever your preset conditions are. Uh, we've got the active driver's seat controls, uh, front leg bolster, dynamic uh, side bolsters that will keep you in the seat. Uh, each side inflates on the opposite side of the turn. Adjustable bolster settings, uh, massaging seats, and you can raise and lower the lumbar and uh, bring the lumbar in and out. Uh, that pretty much rounds out the interior features of this vehicle. Um, if you've got any questions, please give us a call. Phone number is 816-659-3027, or you can email us at hello at purepursuitauto.com.